Hey everyone, real quick one thing to this video being Surfshark VPN. So I've been using Surfshark VPN literally for years now. It is my virtual private network of choice and here is why. First off, it is unlimited devices. I can use it on my phone, my computer. I can have my mother and my father use it as well. It helps protect me while I'm out and about using public Wi-Fi networks, which I do all the time. It protects my credit card data. It protects my login data. It prevents hackers from stealing my identity. So now if you're wondering what a virtual private network is well essentially it helps anonymize your data and allows surfing the web to be done a lot safer you can use it to help change your geography whether you want to shop internationally like at a dot ca a dot com and it can also allow you to option more viewing options on your favorite subscriptions like disney plus netflix etc so if you live somewhere you can't get disney plus use surfshark now you can and right now you can get 83 percent off your surfshark subscription and three months free by clicking that link down below that is surfshark.deals forward slash joel H. Click that link down below to get a wicked deal and to protect your data. So with that, let's get to the rest of the video. Hey everyone, Joel Hansen here. Today I'm at a cold, cold California. Yes, it's 57 degrees out, guys. This is cold. Here my good friend, Mr. Blaine. If you guys don't know Blaine, now you do. Great guy. Today we're in Chino, Chino, California at El Rey Taqueria. Yes, El Rey de las Tortas Incorporated or Del Rey, El Rey Taqueria. Here to do their big burrito challenge. Yes, you're doing a big burrito challenge. So this is a uh, about five pound burrito. It says about four and a half, five pounds. It includes uh, meats of your choice. Then there's of course beans, rice, uh, tomatoes, onions, lettuce. It is a wet burrito, so it's served with a sauce on top. Um, in regards to the meats, they have everything from like some more domestic or you know familiar items like carne asada, which is beef, chicken, carnitas, which is pork. Um, then there's uh, they have like lingua, which is pretty cool. They have chorizo. Um, so yeah, pretty much that's about that. You do have 30 minutes to complete the burrito, and if you do not, it is about $26, I believe, $26, $27. So that's about that. So 30 minutes, let's go eat some food, so that's fun. If we do, we get the meal for free. So let's, let's go eat. All right, everyone, so here are the burrito. It definitely looks pretty good. So it is a wet burrito, get covered in the green chili sauce. Um, and here with my choice of meats, I actually went with lingua as per their recommendation, which is tongue. You've never had it? I had it once, it was good. Never have today. And also with chorizo, so half and half. Um, inside we also have a number of different vegetables. Uh, I think there's beans, rice, all that good stuff. So yeah, 30 minutes to complete the burrito to get it for free. And I thought the burrito is about $26. So with that, we're gonna start here just momentarily. I'm gonna pull the sleeves up and uh, definitely won't have an inclination. So we only have a plastic spoon, but I do have some gloves just in case it's a little saucy to say the least. But how about we get started? We'll say the count of Ooh, saucy. Let's say five, four, three, two, one. Let us go. Very, actually, that's really nicely flavored. Ditch the spoon. Let's just try to maybe eat. Nah. We'll see how this goes. I'm just gonna kind of eat this. Chorizo. Beans, rice. The sauce is good too. The salsa. Hey everyone, welcome to this video. Today we are here at El Rey de las Tortas Inc. Or El Rey Taqueria is kind of what they also call it. So El Rey Taqueria here in Chino, California. Here taking on their big burrito challenge. So this is about a like five pound-ish burrito, four and a half, five pounds. Um, pretty straightforward. Again, you have all your veggies in there. You also get to pick your meats. I went with lingua, tongue, they said it was nice and soft, but then they also had like chorizo and other soft options. Um, but yeah, they had like a wide, wide, large variety of meats. Um, now you did have the standard toppings, you could not replace them, but it'd be like lettuce, tomato, onions, 
all that good stuff. It was served wet, again, green sauce on top, adding a lot of moisture, which just makes it easier to eat. Um, as we said, we do have 30 minutes to complete the challenge. To me, which would put that as like a beginner challenge. So we're talking like, let's say like four and a half, five pounds, 30 minutes, especially with a burrito. Burritos as food challenges are just easier to eat in general. Everything's kind of already mixed up, wet and moist. So I'd say this is a beginner, like pretty beginner challenge. And you can see there's the wall of fame all around me, which is a compilation of both the burrito winners and the torta challenge winners. Big burrito. Woo. A little messy. <laughs> so yes, they also had a torta challenge here, uh, which is about, again, like a five pound torta challenge. I may or may not also have done that. Um, but yeah, obviously this we have this burrito here as well, and it's about a thirty dollar price tag if you fail. A bit over three minutes. Ooh. I know I have gloves on, but I just feel bad about picking up this spoon with such dirty hands. That's set up four and a half minutes in. Probably about a third of the burrito in this tray. But overall, this was definitely a solid burrito challenge. I generally enjoy burrito challenges just as they're tasty, they're generally easy to eat, and it's just a food I enjoy. However, in much of the world, a wet burrito is not a thing. And so, I want you to comment down below if you prefer a wet burrito or a dry burrito. So let's get a hashtag wet, hashtag dry. No, this will not speak to any of your other preferences of other activities or things you will do, just only burritos. So hashtag wet, hashtag dry. And again, what a wet burrito is, is a burrito served covered in sauce and or salsa. So it is a little messy, but hey, like I said, comment down below your preference, hashtag wet, hashtag dry. And ultimately, let's tune on in and let's see what, well, hopefully we can beat this. So let's see what happens. <laughs>
And we are finished. Thank, thank you. About 7 minutes, 13 seconds. Whew. 7 15, whatever it was. Very delicious, actually. Really enjoyed that burrito. The sauces were very good on it. The uh, lingua and the trees were very flavorful with it. I liked both as well. I will say, guys, just because lingua to eating tongue is not super common in a lot of our North American cultures, specifically America, Canada, etc., it's good. Oh, excuse me. It's good. I definitely give it a go. But yeah, I really enjoyed the flavors here, guys. For that, we do get the $26 meal for free, which is pretty sweet. And we do get our picture up on the Wall of Fame as well. If you look around, you can see all the walls, uh, the pictures on the wall here as well. Um, I just said as well like twice. Anyway, you get the picture, guys. So that was pretty cool. Hope you enjoyed the video. Not a very long one, definitely a bit of a quick one. But a big, 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 like, fair size. It was a thick burrito. Pretty dang thick. Thick and wet. Thick and wet. But that, I want to give huge thanks to Mr. Blaine. Blaine, thank you for not only accompanying me, but he was using his official Randy Santel timer for me today, guys. Look at that. He has that click, that beautiful time on that button. You heard that beep earlier. All due to Blaine. Thank you, my friend. So that, guys, that's about it. You know, guys, gals, everybody, people, you rock. And that was really cool. So if you're ever in the area, definitely, definitely check it out. Chino. Chino, Chino, Chino. Cool spot. Staff have been very friendly. Food has been good. And I have no complaints. So that one. So next time they had to say happy, healthy, hungry. Happy eating. Have a lovely day. And that's about that. I'm gonna go take a nap. Until next time. If you guys like the video, hit that subscribe button. Check out Jolies.com, cop yourself some merch. Share the video, comment, all that stuff. Why? Because it does actually help other people find the video. If you like it, let me know down below as well. And uh, that's about it, guys. So have a good night. Guess what? You rock, yes, you rock. Thank you so much for watching the video. I totally appreciate it. I hope you left me a comment down below. I'd love to read them. I hope you also liked that video. Hey, by the way, click my face. You can subscribe. Yes, subscribe. That way you always get my uploads. You won't miss me when I'm in your town. And I also picked two videos for you. Yes, two videos I know you'll love right here. So watch one of those, hit my face. And at that, thank you so much, you rock.